Welcome. In this short tutorial video, we're going to take a look at how to publish the contents of a Google Sheet to the web. In addition to sharing content by using the share option up here, which will allow you to permit additional people access to the document, there are times when we might want to make all of the contents of a Google Sheet that we're working with publicly available on the web. To do that, we can come into the file menu and open it up and then down towards the bottom you should see an option labeled publish to the web. Let's go ahead and click this to open up an additional menu. So here we have two separate ways of publishing this to the web. The first is by providing um, a link to either the entire document itself, so all of the sheets that are contained in this. In this example we only have one sheet, but if there were more sheets we could give it people access to the entire document um, or we could give them access to just a particular sheet and so what we can do with using this link share method is either share it as a web page a CSV file a TSV file which is very similar to a CSV file or as a PDF so I'm going to go through both of these and just show you what this looks like if I choose to share either way so I'm going to go ahead and share this initial one as a web page we can see that it's already been published down here and let's drag this up. Um, and so there are a couple of other options that we can we can do down here. So one of the really cool things is that this can be very dynamic. So as you're updating values in the Google Sheet, it's going to go ahead and reflect this web page as long as you have this automatically republished when changes are made checked. And so what that's going to do is every time a change is made in the spreadsheet, it's going to republish this web page. So let's go ahead and copy this link and paste it into a browser address bar and see what that looks like on the other end. So there we've got a very simple representation of our Google Sheet. Great. So let's take a look at some of the other examples. Occasionally you might want to share with people um, in a format that they can work with. Right now this is just HTML being rendered so it's kind of useless for us if we were going to send it to another application that was going to consume it and do something with it. So a common data exchange format that people use is CSV especially for this example. So let's go ahead and publish this as a CSV now and see what happens. So I'm going to go ahead and copy our link and then I'm going to go ahead and close out this browser window, open up another one and paste our link in there, press go, and it should take us out to a web page. And then since we're accessing that file directly, it is going to go ahead and download for us in our browser for us to open up in either Google Sheets or Excel, or if another application was taking this, it could take this file, consume it, and do something else with it. So very cool ways to publish things to the web. The other option that we have is to actually embed the entire document or the sheet itself. Um, and we can do this by clicking in here, selecting whether we want to publish the entire document or just sheet one, and then clicking publish, and that'll generate an iframe for us that we can then take and paste and include on a separate website or blog. So thank you for watching. Those are the two easiest ways that you can begin to publish Google Sheets to the web and share your data with other people. Um, if you have any questions or need me to help you troubleshoot anything regarding publishing something to the web using Google Sheets, make sure to leave me a comment in this YouTube video or on my blog. Thanks for watching.